has John Florell been all my life with this? I've been waiting <laughs> for something like this because I'm like you. I throw away food. I forget when I make my homemade bone broth. I'm losing money because I not only am I oxidizing, my food right. is. And John, we don't like to think about it, but you know, air is not the friend of You're our right. food. That's right. You're right. You're absolutely right. When uh, you know, when you buy something in the store, it comes packaged for freshness. And yeah. once you open that package, what happens to the freshness? Bye <laughs> right? bye. As soon as the air hits the food, <laughs> yeah, it starts to go bad. It yes, starts it to go stale. So when you buy a package of well, whatever it is, or maybe sure. you have some leftovers, uh, you take it out of the package. As soon as you open that up, and some of the packages aren't even really that yeah, <laughs> airtight. Yeah, let's be honest. Here's how simple this is. You take your VacuCraft container, pour what's what's in that bag yeah. inside the VacuCraft container. Now you place the lid on the top. I, I guess I made a little bit of a mess there, but here you place the lid on the top. Take the vacuum pump, place it over the center ring, okay. give it a few pumps, and you'll notice there's a little, a little, uh, a, it's, I call it a little half moon right here. Yeah. When that indents, that means you, you're under vacuum. It creates vacuum inside that container, nice. seals the lid on, but it, now your food will stay fresh longer. It so, will. <laughs> yes. no, it really will. So it saves you a ton of money. Right here on the top, you'll notice there's a date ring. They're clear, yeah. so you can adjust this to whatever date that you like. Let's say, say for example, today was the, what, the second? We're gonna put it on the second. Now you know when you put that in there. When that sits in the pantry, the next time you pull Absolutely. it out, and you I don't know, know when it was you, in there. Not only in Florida, moisture, it makes the rice you know, taste yes. stale. It makes the coffee taste not so fresh. Also keeps the little critters and the bugs out, because yep. you know, I don't care where you live, you know, we've all got that. Just so you know, it's a whole system, which I think is genius. Yeah. I like the fact that you don't have to worry about plugs or electricity, so if you take it, camping, if you take it boating, if it's, you know, if you love your RV, if you're the snowbird, I mean, that second home, dormitory, assisted living, doesn't matter, or the fact that you get a whole system, like That's I said, right. three canisters, and then... You get the large, right? medium, and small canisters, yep. okay, and you get that lunchbox container. Nice. Now, that one, I'll tell you, this is perfect yeah. to fit right in a lunchbox, you fit a, fit a sandwich in there perfectly, yeah. some chips in there, and you vacuum seal it. That can, can go right with you. I've got steaks marinating in there right now, and I'll explain how the marinating works. In okay. fact, to do that, I'm going to move these aside, gotcha. okay? And what you get in that set, you get the four the four containers. Right. You get the small, medium and large cylinders and this one. You're nice. going to love this container for the lunchbox. It's the perfect size. Now, the, the, all of these are Triton plastic, so they're very, oh, very tough. That's actually okay? like the best plastic that you can get. Yes. I mean, it really and is. the lids, I'll tell you, they're see-through see lids, but I want you to see this. I've got a bunch of marshmallows in here, yep. and I vacuum sealed it already, okay? Using the pump, you sure. vacuum seal it, and watch what happens. And you can hear this. When I release the vacuum, you'll hear it, but I want you to see it too. Watch what happens. Okay. That's cool. When you put things under vacuum, it removes the air, okay? which means your food will stay fresher longer, yeah. okay? Now you can take that lid off. You take your marshmallows out and pla place the lid back on, however many you need, and watch this. You can actually watch those marshmallows grow You're as good. I pump this, creating the vacuum inside the container. Now, what this means for you is when you're marinating meats, yeah. okay? And in this large container, okay, you can put a whole chicken, <laughs> right? And oh, marinate a whole entire chicken marinate it how you like uh, with whatever that. marinade you like and the best part is what happens when you put it under vacuum it opens up all the cells in the meat okay which allows yeah. the marinade to penetrate so when you release that, all that marinade nice. is inside the chicken. Oh, it's marinating great. in hours instead of days. It is genius. <laughs> right? Now here's the thing, that flex pay is for this hour. So John was kind enough to come in. This is it for the weekend. He's back next week, but not with this item. And regardless, that flex was done for this show. So, you know, I don't care if you cook a little, if you cook a lot, even if it's the kibbles and bits for the dogs and the cats right. and the kids. Oh, keep it all know, fresh. I, you know, I don't know about you, but I am a fanatic. I hate it when soda goes flat and yep. I hate it when chips get stale. So if it's your snack crackers, if it's the cookies that you buy for the kids, if it's, you know, the corn chips, sure. I mean, it, the rice. Leftover the, soups, absolutely. leftover stews. Hey, leftover chili. We all know how good chili is, yeah. okay, Left the day after. Imagine under under vacuum. When you seal it in that vacuum sealed in the container, your leftover chili absorbs everything yes. so much faster. But watch this. Now, you, you, here's the best part about these yeah. containers. You've got your small, medium, and large. Yeah. So you can keep your coffee, your flour, yeah. your sugar. Keep them right out on your countertop as yeah. canisters for storage. You know it's going to stay fresh. Listen, this one's under vacuum. Watch what happens. Oh, wow. 
when I release that, that's flour, yeah. okay? That's fresh. Now, you're not gonna get any bugs in there. Nope. It's not gonna go bad. It's not gonna go stale. No when I vacuum, when I put this under vacuum, oh, wow. you'll literally see that flour <laughs> expand inside oh that God. container. Now, that means that's gonna stay fresher longer. Yeah. Imagine your coffee, if you have coffee stored in one of these, you know, as soon as you open up that bag of coffee or the, the can right. of coffee, they all they come to you vacuum sealed and yeah. they do that for a reason yes, to preserve do. the freshness as soon as you open that bag up or as soon as you pop that can open the air gets in yeah. and your coffee starts to go stale yes. you start to lose the aroma the flavor but with the vacuum craft seal uh, containers listen you can hear, that's, that's cool. the sound of freshness. And when you smell, you pop the lid open yeah. in the morning, that coffee's gonna smell phenomenal. It is, and John, you know what it's like? It's like getting a new bag of coffee every yes, time you open it up. every time. So what's a bag of coffee? Like $7, conservatively? Yes. So it's like $7. Oh, the next time you use it, like another $7. By the way, that's your flex pay. So every <laughs> time, if you use this four times, you paid for your coffee. I mean, seriously, because you have to remember, that, like John said, that's why manufacturers vacuum seal their products yes. because that keeps the freshness, it keeps all the moisture, it keeps the flavor, it keeps the taste, keeps the nutrients in. Now you're doing the same thing that a manufacturer would do. That's why it's getting a fresh bag of flour every time you use it. Oh, you can hear oh, that, okay? Sandwich. Imagine popping this in your lunchbox, okay? You've got that fresh sandwich, nice soft bread yep. when you get to work. You don't have to worry about wrapping it up in, in uh, right. you know, $2 worth of plastic wrap, okay, and then it getting soggy. Imagine putting this in a cooler with ice if you're going out on the boat. You can keep your sandwiches yeah. in here so you can throw it right on top of the ice to keep it cool. No water can get in there. No liquids can get out. In fact, just to show you this, okay, I've got, I put some color-coded water in here. Now, this could be soup. It could be stew. It could be leftover uh, uh, chili. I want you to see this. When it's vacuum sealed, it's locked in there, okay? If you're going to travel with these, it's perfect because if they tip over in the back seat oh. of your car, yeah. You don't have to worry about the lid popping off. Yeah. It's all vacuum sealed. Now, to release it, there's a little yellow button right here on the top. Okay. And what you'll do with your finger is just press that to the side, okay? Don't press down on it. Press it to the side like this. I'll show you real quick. You'll yep. hear it. You can hear that nice. vacuum release. Now you can pop the lid off. Yeah. And down, now you can take out what you need, right. place the lid back on, and watch this. Because all you do is place that little pump. Now you get two pumps with your set today, too. And when this little button inverts, that means you've got that, that factory vacuum seal. Good that, tip. that Yep. And Good tip. now it's locked in there. I, it's not going to come I, out. Whatever's you, in there this, is in there. This will pay for itself a thousand times over. Because yes, it again, will. I really mean it when I say it's like getting a fresh bag think of coffee about, every time you use it. it think about fruit? what happens to fruits oh. or like berries. Uh, you buy berries. You put them God. in the fridge. What happens? They're in it. As soon as they hit the air, okay, yeah, they come in a little plastic container in the store. Yeah. This was a whole plastic container that I bought in the grocery store. Yep. It fits yeah. right in here. Yep. You vacuum it. Now it's going to stay fresh it will. for uh, weeks instead of days. Yeah. <laughs> okay? well, I mean, it was so Same funny because I bought blueberries today. So it's like a mortgage payment. I mean, and you end up throwing half of them away yep. as soon as the air hits it, basically. How about, how about uh, making avocados last yes. for a week in the fridge, okay, instead of, you know, they turn brown in hours I as know. soon as they hit the they air. Do. When you create that vacuum, listen, you can hear it. That's Ooh. the sound of freshness, okay? Yeah. That, look, as soon as, you, as soon as that hits the air, it starts to go bad. By removing the air from the container that your food is in, yeah. using the pump on top, and again, you can see that little button invert, okay? It's okay. inverted, that means there's vacuum. Now there's no air in there, it removed it. It's, now it's under vacuum, so it's not gonna go bad as fast. So yeah. it saves you so much money it, on fruits it, and vegetables. It, it does, hey, just so you know, we would love to say hi to you, by the way. If you're calling or if you have this hold at the end of the Call. We'd love to meet and greet you. If you have my dash that is coming up, we definitely <laughs> want to hear from you. But you know, John, I think if, if for bakers, yes. I don't bake a lot, but what ticks me off about baking is every time I bake, I have to throw away the flour or the brown sugar that I used the last that. time that I bake. Now yeah. I don't have to yeah. do that. Well, once you open a, a package up from the store, whether it be flour like this yeah. or sugar or whatever or whatever it may be, it starts, to, the, the air hits yes. it as soon as, and who, and you know, when you put it in your pantry, look at this, when I vacuum this, you can actually see that flower grow. Yeah. You can see it removing the air, which makes that flower lighter, fluffier. It'll keep it fresher Tastes longer. Better. Okay. Yeah. And again, it's the same thing with these. If you're keeping things in your pantry now in plastic bags that you just fold over the top on yes. and the air can still get in there, they go stale. They when you keep them under vacuum, listen, they are going to stay fresher longer. Did you see those actually move in there yeah, when I, I released that vacuum? You can see it, and it, like, the kids love it. You, know, you give your kids a bag full of marshmallows yeah, and a vacuum craft container. It's like 
a science, it's like a science fair for them. It is. But once you create that vacuum, there's no air in that container, so your food stays fresh. It's not gonna go stale. So, the, you know, whether it be coffee, and again, the best way to explain it is with the marshmallows, because you can literally see the vacuum, uh, what, the, what the, the, the effect of the vacuum inside this canister. I'm gonna release this, but watch, watch through the canister here. You can see as the air yeah. goes back in there, <laughs> how it affects those nice. marshmallows. So, so remember that FlexPay is only for this hour, guys, and you do not have to choose. You get the small, the medium, large. You also get what we're calling the lunch size, so that small rectangular piece. You're getting two pumps, no electricity required, but this is John's only show of the weekend. So when he comes back next week, not getting this. Those marshmallows, are, that also is a good indication of why you marinate in minutes instead yes, of hours or exactly. days, Exactly, right? when you're marinating foods in here, whether it be a whole chicken, like we have here, or maybe it's steaks for the barbecue, oh, okay? The you have a couple of steaks, maybe it's pork chops. This one is the perfect size for, I've got a couple of, uh, I think th th these are uh, strip steaks, okay? New York strips, they're perfect size, it's the perfect size to marinate two steaks at a time. You can see the marinade, you can see how under vacuum, yeah. it opens up. It Maybe you can even see this. We're gonna, we're gonna. Let me push this button. Watch this. Watch what happens inside. You can see how it shrinks down. Right. Those are the cells of the meat going back down to normal size. But the marinade's in the meat now. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, and it's yeah, only yeah. been in there for like a couple of hours. So now you can marinate in hours instead of days. Okay. Yeah. And completely marinate that food. A whole chicken marinated That's overnight. Great. Okay. Instead of a week. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, no, think exactly. about it. Exactly. I mean, it's really true. So the whole idea is, I think we're all trying to buy organic or fresh. I think we were, as consumers, we're smarter now. Yeah. And the the good news bad news is that stuff goes bad You like can overnight. see what happens inside yeah. there. When I release that vacuum, you can actually probably see that chicken plump up yeah. as I remove oh, the air sure. from the container. Yeah, for sure. Okay, and then that, that allows that marinade to get into all the nooks and crannies of, that, of the meat. And when I release it, watch that chicken inside. Yeah. You can see how it shrinks back down. Yeah. Just like the marshmallows, watch this. Oh, nice. Okay, it's the same thing, only now you're doing it with meats. So for a marinating system, it's amazing. <laughs> it really is. So you know what? From meats to marinades to popcorn to chips to coffee, I mean to teas. Oh, sure. You know, Keep your cereals bits. in cereals, it. All your dry cereals rice, will stay fresh. fruits, vegetables. I mean, anything that you want to keep fresh or longer, that price, now remember, it's not only a $10 price adjustment, that flex pay is is good for this show. It's something that they did for this show. Of course, yes, hold at the end of the call. We'd love to say hi to you tonight during this, you know, late breaking kitchen edition. And then of course, Beauty Bioscience at 10. I'm telling you, if you only got this for marinades, it would yeah. pay for itself. Because oh, we know. all know that marinated meat tastes so much better, but most of us don't do it because we forget to, right? Yeah, exactly. And that's the thing. We don't have, you know, if you remember to do it, right. marinated meats are fantastic. Yeah. But most of us don't remember. Look, watch this. Here, remember. Yeah. Under vacuum, it stays crispy. It stays it fresh. It stay, it, you don't have that staleness anymore. So for chips, for, for those cheese yeah. puffs. So, so if you really want to put the love. snap, the crackle, and the pop back it, in the right. cereal <laughs> instead right. of the soggy, you know, Absolutely. the sad, the tired. So everything you from this. your dry cereals to leftover soups to leftover stews to chili for marinating, you'll love it. For your berries, for fruits and vegetables, you can't beat it because it makes them last longer. It does. Imagine, you know, if you buy berries and you only use use a half a container and you two days later you're throwing the rest out because they're going bad yeah. with the vacuum craft containers it will keep them fresher for weeks instead of it, days it really will i gotta tell you you're to, you're to save so much money by using this seven dollars and fifty cents yours is here as long as you're making your way to the phones john thank you for coming in to do this oh, thank you. love that pleasure. sound of freshness <laughs> it, it, it is makes me smile <laughs> all right so we have a marshmallow <laughs> yeah i know <laughs> you smell so I know, good God, it looks so good <laughs> all right seven dollars 50 cents for this hour. Uh, we are coming back with my blender. I did a head-to-head -head test with the big V guy earlier today, and I'm telling you what...